chosen generation We've been called for to show His excellence all I require for life, God has given me, and I know who I am. Bonsoir, bonjour. Ça dépend de là où vous êtes. Hein? <rire> Chez nous ici, c'est l'après-midi. Et nous sommes très, très heureux de vous avoir là-bas dehors. Aujourd'hui encore, euh, je suis allée au Nigeria cette fois-ci. Hein? Oui, je suis allée au Nigeria et je vous ai amené euh, un très bon cadeau. Hein? Oui, et aujourd'hui, on, on aura un français tellement, tellement sucré parce que j'ai hâte d'entendre de, <rire> son français. Mais avant que je vous introduise à mon invité du, du jour, euh, je souhaite qu'on partage la parole ensemble, oui, parce que la parole de Dieu, ça éclaircit le cœur, et ça éclaircit ta vie, oui, quand tu, quand tu te trempes dans la parole de Dieu, ça te fait briller, ça te fait éclaircir, et tu brilles, et tu souris, oui, c'est comme ça, ça doit être, oui, parce que c'est comme ça, Dieu a voulu que ça soit. Euh, Aujourd'hui, euh, encore, j'ai aussi allé à aux États-Unis, hein. oui, moi, je, moi, je voyage trop, moi, <rire> je voyage et je suis revenue avec la chanson de Dr. Karine à thème et il a fait un futur, elle a fait un featuring avec euh, euh, Rochi Osvaline. Rochi Osvaline, c'est un Camerounais euh, euh, qui est basé ici à, à Boya et on va danser ensemble. Et aussi, j'ai découvert euh, Félix Chaquet. Oui. Ce sont les artistes que, les, ou les, et les chantres, puisque ce n'est pas eux tous qui sont les artistes qu'on va découvrir aujourd'hui. Mais avant ça, on va prendre une autre jingle et quand on va revenir, on va parler de notre verset du jour. Et après, on va faire notre gis gis. Let's go! And of course, today we are taking our verse for today from the book of Matthew, Matthew 28, verse 30. Get your Bibles, get your Bibles. I told you we do the word of God or we read it with a glass of juice because you are supposed to be enjoying while you are reading his word. So Matthew 11, 28, what does it say? Come to me, all you who are weary. And burden and I will give you rest take my yoke upon you and learn from me for I am gentle and humble in heart and you will find best or you will find rest for your souls for my yoke is easy and my burden is light this is for everyone there it's even for me too who oh who at times want to carry things on ourselves yes a lot is happening yeah, uh, we have a lot of struggles the economy is getting even harder inflation everywhere and at times everything just weighs on you it becomes so heavy and uh, when it gets to that point we feel like ah uh, okay let me think of one or two let me do the math and see if i can come up with something to come out of this situation and it, it overweights us so much so that we at times don't think to go back to God to, to tell him, ah, Baba Mia, fa, how do we go with this thing? How do I come out of this thing? It's really heavy for me and all the rest. So today, Matthew 28, verse the Matthew 11, verse 28 to 30 is telling you that God is a place of rest. Yes, if you want rest, you have rest in Christ. At, the, at his feet you find rest so don't carry your burdens don't carry your yokes don't carry that thing that disturbs you just carry it to him okay myself i learned i learned to be in that place where i allow him carry things for me because you know where you feel like you can handle things all all alone at times it weighs you down we are humans okay it weighs you down situations overwhelm you so you have to learn how to bring yourself to the place of rest and allow God to carry your burdens because his yoke is easy and his burden 
is light we're going to worship god this day we turn this wonderful song from Philly Shake. she's an amazing uh, 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 worshiper and a minister of god and i brought her for you let's go k in i worship you do not forget to download follow her on social media felicia k youtube felicia k facebook anywhere that you are connected to follow her and download this wonderful so enjoy with your family call your village people if you listen together it's very important that we listen to this amazing song she's a cameroonian and i told you this season i'm in the business of bringing new artists to you yes we have seen we are there have been an, uh, uh, an occurrence a real occurrence of faces that we see every day so i want something new so that's why i've been traveling i'm going from one place to the other just to make sure that we have a new taste for each edition hope i'm meeting your expectations but before you get to answer my you know my request this morning i told you that i went to uh, nigeria and i brought to you our brother that is over there he does music and uh, today i said we will have a heart-to-heart -heart discussion because i'm really interested in how he will leave fufu and eru kondre kati kati achu and will decide to go and stay in nigeria i for what i cannot leave this country for anything if i have to go then i have to carry kondre i have to carry kati kati i have to carry achu Before you I understand I have to carry everything <laughs> and go with it. We understand each other, right? So let's make welcome Zer Rogers all the way from Nigeria. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> what do you say with the speaking bo? Eh? Ah. I'm bad. The, uh, the guy is wrong. Hey, I'm doing well. Wrong get. <laughs> Thank you. I'm doing well. Oh, should I? At least, at least we will understand each other now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, now let's go back. Let's go back to our, you know, to our comrade, to our comrade, com comrade yeah. feeling. Sure. Comment tu vas? Comment tu vas? Ça va? Je vais bien. Ah, yeah. he speaks French. Uh, <laughs> this is going to be an interesting uh, edition. Oh a very interesting one. Yeah. Alors comment? Uh, qui est? Zero, je, 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 je pense que depuis que la caméra s'est posée sur vous, les gens disent Ah, il est bon, ouais, mais, <rire> mais, mais qui est cette personne Et Comment est-ce qu'il a fait Pourquoi est-ce qu'il a quitté Cameroun pour aller au Nigeria C'est pour la musique ou quoi Alors, c'est à vous de, le, de répondre, non Oui. Mm -hmm. euh, bon, bref, moi je m'appelle Zer Roger. Mm -hmm. Je suis, euh, euh, comment on dit en français là On dit euh, musique. Gospel music minister. Ok, tu es un chantre gospel. Yeah. So, bon, moi, moi, j'essaye d'éviter de dire que je suis un artiste gospel, quoi. Parce okay. que je ne suis pas artiste gospel. I am a gospel music minister. All right. So, that is the whole thing, thing about it. Bon, moi, je suis euh, à Lagos, au Nigeria. Mm -hmm. Et euh, je, suis de, je suis là depuis, il est là, 7 à 10, 8 à 10 ans. Ah okay. oui. Oui. Je suis euh, un entrepreneur là-bas. D'accord. Oui, à part ça, euh, je fais la musique. La musique que je fais, c'est pour remercier Dieu mm -hmm. pour son bonheur, pour mm -hmm. tout ce qu'il a fait pour moi, ma famille, mes amis, et pour le bonheur du monde aussi. Donc, décidément, vous n'avez pas quitté le Cameroun pour aller au Nigeria pour faire la musique Non, non, non. Ce n'est pas la musique qui m'a mené au Nigeria. Oh, okay. C'est euh, le business. D'accord. Parce que quand. Quand je sais que chaque, chaque personne a une vision. Mm -hmm. Et je suis né avec la vision euh, de l'entrepreneuriat. Mm -hmm. Et j'aime créer. I have a creative spirit. Mm -hmm. Ok, bon. Et quand j'ai quand quand regardé dans les pays africains, mm -hmm. et euh, avec un peu de, de, de la population, mm -hmm. la population était aussi l'un de mes soucis. Et le, et le Nigeria, Nigeria est over 200 millions d'inhabitants. Mm -hmm. Et je me suis dit, ok, si je suis au Nigeria et je mets un produit au marché, mm -hmm. je n'ai pas voulu travailler aux gens. J'ai voulu créer le travail pour les gens. D'accord. Oui, j'ai dit, ok, si je mets un produit au marché, ça peut me permettre d'employer les, les, les uns et les autres. Je peux mm -hmm. créer. I can, I'm, I am creative mm -hmm. and the taking up my creative ideas mm -hmm. i put it in the market i am able to equally participate 
in the employment scheme. Okay. So I looked at it and I was like, okay, if I can put this product in the market and I have only out of 200 million inhabitants, j'ai juste 2 million qui consomment mon produit, je suis okay. Wow. J'ai comparé le Cameroun, le Nigeria, en termes de population, en termes de taxes aussi. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oui. <laughs> Les taxes étaient toujours un problème. Euh, au Cameroun, nos taxes au Cameroun sont vraiment. Moi, je ne. Je ne I cannot play around. Our taxes in Cameroon are just unbearable. <laughs> yeah. I think someday, someday we're going so to be delivered from I that. <laughs> I looked at the Nigerian system. Their system is well organized and prepared for business, for investment. Mm -hmm. They are very good in and their, then their tax system is, I don't want to say zero, is almost zero. Anyways, we're going to we're going to come back to that yeah. when I, when when I, when I invite you next time for a business talk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Today we're doing kingdom business. Yeah. <laughs> we're Thank doing you. kingdom business. Yeah. And uh, it's really really uh, amazing to see that you are able to excel in uh, a community as that where you would, you came in just as a normal brother. Yeah. Uh, somewhere you didn't know and you really excelled like that. Now we're not going to compare. Yeah. I want, I, want, I want you to, to give uh, an evaluation, yeah. a remark. Yeah. It's been over 10 years you are in Nigeria, so yeah. I think you're in a better place to, give, to, to, to do this particular remark. For sure, for sure. Now, if you were to give a remark on the approach when it comes to um, um, gospel music in Cameroon yeah. and that in Nigeria, what would be your remark? Well, thank mm -hmm. you. My remark actually... The gospel music in Nigeria is too advanced. Okay. It's too advanced. And then the people are extremely welcoming. All right. Then they consume their own. Okay. So long as it is being produced in Nigeria, they consume their own. They don't care where you are coming from. As long as you are in their chart, okay. you are part of them. Yes. So... But look at looking at my country, Cameroon, it's the contrary. Okay. These are my personal opinions. All right. The gospel music in Cameroon, the entertainment in, in Cameroon is really I'm trying to get the right word. I don't know why I want to use a word that are not really people may interpret it in their own way. Okay. It's not really that friendly the way it's supposed to be. Okay. <coughs> there are there is so much hate speeches and uh, so much backbiting, backstabbing, so much hatred, so much gossip, mm -hmm. so much negative. Th there's too much negative energy. Instead of us using that, the energy we have to promote ourselves and build the kingdom, we are instead using it against each other. We are kind of in a competitive environment. Okay. So the question I have is that as a minister, with whom are you competing? where is the grace coming from we have one source of grace and uh, god dispatches his grace to his creations the way he wants it so your grace can never be mine we can be gospel ministers gospel music ministers but that doesn't mean we have the same calling okay you may be called st strictly on the section of worship okay i may be called strictly on the section of praise another person may be called strictly on the section of afro and so on and so forth somebody another person may be called round in the entire gens or in the entire sec sections so there is absolutely no reason no need mm -hmm. for competition trying to know this one is better than this person oh this is this no that's not i don't to me personally that's not okay in nigeria we don't discriminate okay. and we try to avoid comparison we consume the music as beautiful as it is. If I release now, it goes viral. It goes good in Nigeria and everybody is okay with it. Mm -hmm. Another person releases, it may be the same, it may be the same type, but okay. they, will not com they will not say, okay, Zay Rogers is much better than Joe Price. Okay. Or Joe Price is much better than uh, 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 Iben. Mm -hmm. Or Iben is much better than uh, uh, Snatch. Snatch is much better than uh, 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 Ada. So it, it, it doesn't go. So we consume it 
the way it comes and we give God glory just like that. Wow. So um, normally <coughs> if we were if we were to do an evaluation from the yesteryears yeah. uh, of the Cameroon gospel uh, industry, yeah. we are going to notice that it has grown over time. Yeah. It has grown over time, mm. it has advanced. Yeah. But maybe it hasn't gotten to that place yet yeah. so all those things you mentioned about backbiting about comparison and all the rest are you trying to to say that uh, it's those things that is uh, that are hindering the advancement of the cameroon gospel industry exactly those are some of the things that are hindering because okay like for instance i grew up listening to uh, elizabeth Eke. okay and uh, Elizabeth Teke happens to be one of my mentors. If you look at my press release. Oh, yes, yes. And uh, I listen to her music. Mm -hmm. And uh, she's just one of those gospel artists in, in Cameroon that she is focused in her core. Okay. She, she, has, she doesn't really look into how, who is doing better than who, or who is who. Because even though we are in the gospel world, we have individual cores and individual graces. Mm -hmm. So we don't need to compare things and when you compare things you find yourself moving out of your focus so some of some of the things that are hindering it is true the gospel industry in Cameroon has advanced mm -hmm. but I am expecting it to be even much more better than the way it is now now the way forward is how can we move come out of here of the valley where we find ourselves the only way we can come out of it is by loving our own okay and appreciating our own consuming our own without blemish okay without com without comparing the fans or followers should stop comparing their ministers with other okay. ministers they should be contented with what they are giving out if you don't like for instance my recent song, I am in love with Jesus, and not everybody loves it. Okay. Not everybody loves it. I think we're going to come to that. Yes. So, those who don't love it, you won't hear them, for instance, in Nigeria, criticizing the song. They play the pop, they don't like it, they just go to where they are. So, those who love it, you will see them following and commenting. Mm -hmm. But here, you will see others with, I, I, I'm saying all these things out of what I see on the net. Okay. Yes, out of what I see on the net. The, the social media is a very strong tool, uh, um, a very strong tool that God, through science, has provided it for us to be able to spread the word, to spread the word in any form, to reach the four corners of the earth. But we instead use it, some people use it in a negative way. Okay. Instead of promoting, they, are de they, are, they use it to degrade some persons and so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. So the internet is a very strong tool that we can use to give value and better value to the Cameroonian gospel music. Hmm. Yes. The, the gospel music, if you compare it from yesterday to now, it has advanced, but it is not where it's supposed to be by now. Okay. By now, it's supposed to be far off. Okay. Why is the Nigerian gospel industry doing well? These people, they consume their own. They, they are not there to say this person is better than this person. This person is this. This person is that. No, they enjoy it with their full body, spirit, and soul. And they promote it. They use it on their different uh, uh, ceremonies, platforms, and so on and so forth. For instance, I have been in Nigeria for long. Hi. I can count how many times I overheard even by driving or in a public bus or driving my car or maybe in the in my neighborhood Ni nigerians don't play i would say don't why because the ratio is just too small okay they don't consume foreign music for a nigerian to appreciate even an american artist music a nigerian artist must have future that artist whoa <laughs> That's what a strong information. <laughs> yes. A Nigerian artist must have future that artist before they start you before you even start hearing them mm -hmm. playing that artist song. And even when they are playing that song, for instance, like me now, if I future take for example for uh, for instance, if mm -hmm. I future Elizabeth Teke now, mm -hmm. 
Nigerians will play the music along. In the course of playing it, that's where they start saying, oh, okay, Rogers being our own. That's why it's even bloggers in Nigeria. They don't even block me as a Cameroonian artist. They block me as a Nigerian artist. So they welcome everybody. So long as you are within their circle. And mm. then you are, you, you are there with them. They are people. They are welcoming. Wow. So we need to come out of that, that, that space of comparing ministers. Taking them with their grace. Because their graces are different. The graces are different. Yes. Okay, we have been talking and talking. I want you to have a taste. I've played it here before, yeah. so it's not new to you, but it's going to sound really new to them because he's here on set. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to have a I'm in love with Jesus, Jesus by Ze Rogers. And when we come back, we're going to talk about this particular song. Yeah. I have very, very strong questions for you. <laughs> I'm ready for you. Very strong questions for you. I'm ready for you. <laughs> All right, Peter, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> These that you make me shamaya. Oh my lord, you are the king of kings. Even when my brain just turned out, only unite them, my brother. Roger, Roger. Thank you, Jesus. Run, run. Jesus, 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 J
He paid the price so that you and I will make it to the end. Okay. No, not like you. I love you, die my more expensive I take. Ah. Oh, I love you too, Tiger. Yeah, see, I'm catching oh, feeling. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, not, I'm not. I'm not catching feeling now for this song. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's a great. It's a great song. With but now I have a problem. Yeah. What's yeah, that? And I think that many people have been asking, sure, why? Yeah. Why use a circular beat? Yeah. Because this song. Was, it's a song by Pato Ranking, Pato Ranking yeah. and Pato Ranking is a secular artist, yeah, based Nigerian in Nigerian secular, artist, secular yeah. artist. So the question has been, was it that you wanted to break through into the Nigerian industry, what or you just liked the beat and felt like you should do a gospel version? So I'm sure you've been asking the same question. It has been coming back and forth. So we have him here today, and he's going to answer your question. Yeah. Over to you. Now, actually, um, did, I didn't really use this. This is not my first gospel song. Okay. I have a couple of them on YouTube and others on, on different stores, Apple, right. these are other stuffs. This is actually just the latest. Okay. And the, one of the reasons I did this song, my, if you listen to my songs that I've released so far before this one, you will notice that my music is, sec is, is, uh, is centered around mercy and love. Okay. So I'm concerned about divine mercy and divine love. Okay. That's my focus in music. So when Panther Ranking sang, use, uh, when he sang for a lady, mm -hmm. I said, okay, if you look at the, my write-up, mm -hmm. my Vivo channel, look at my write-up, you will notice that I said clearly there that others are good at expressing the love they have for their fellow girls or men or wives and so on and so forth mm -hmm. or one another. But we are less concerned about the love we have for God or how much love God has for us. We are good at reciprocating the love that our loved ones are showing us. Mm -hmm. But we forget that that love was taught to us by somebody and that person is Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. So we should learn to reciprocate this love to our Lord Jesus. Mm -hmm. So I now, listening to Panto Rankin's song, I loved it. It's a very good jam. I loved it, but I was like, how do I use this same message to tell the world the love we or I have for God? That was how it started. Mm -hmm. And I came across this song, I was actually driving uh i was driving i think i was driving to lakey mm -hmm. and uh, there was some sort of promotion a carnival promotion mm -hmm. they played the panther ranking song there and uh, as i was driving off uh, my ac had an issue so i decided to say okay let me park to check what is going on so immediately i parked and i stepped out of the car i heard the song okay and uh, it was like I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love, mm -hmm. I'm in love, I'm in love. So that, that love, it entered my ear like, like <laughs> a bomb. <laughs> and uh, I, I stopped, I listened to it very well. Mm -hmm. Immediately I went to Google. Mm -hmm. I typed, I'm in love, it popped up, bah, bam, the ranking. Right. And I, da I, da I downloaded a song. Mm -hmm. When I downloaded a song, I checked my AC and I had to call the AC guy. They checked it and had to... Uh, put it back in order. I continued, I was driving to Lakey, Lakey phase one. And uh, the, I, I started playing the song. As I was playing the song, I played it the first time, I was listening so key. I'm concerned about the wordings in a song. Okay. The beat doesn't move me. Okay. For the beat to move me, the word must come first because the word is power. Okay. So I listened to his wordings and I was like, wow. Very powerful wordings. But now, how do I transcribe these wordings to use them and praise God? So definitely even the lyrics of the song were transcribed from the song. Yes. Oh, okay. So I now said, okay, Pantaron King is singing to a lady. Mm -hmm. Now, let me use the same beat and sing to God. I now called, I now started praying. I have this attitude of meditation that the senior prophet T.B. taught us about. That's why you see me with my, as I'm even talking to you, <laughs> I am, um, that's, that's my nature. Okay. I'm meditating as I'm to say that, so that I should be, so that the spirit of God should constantly be with me. Okay. Because a pause in meditation is a pause in God. Okay. So I, I started med meditating in my spirit, asking God, Father, how do I use this to praise you? 
how do I use this to praise you? And that's how the words started coming. As they were coming, I was rec recording with, with my phone. I recorded it, forwarded the audio voice to the voice record to my uh, producer. And uh, immediately I told him, okay, this is from Panther Rankings beat. I want the beat replicated. Hmm. So oh. he replicated the beat. Oh, it, was, it was kind of an yeah. a special yeah. command. <laughs> so he replicated the beat and they told me, Zay Rogers, your beat is ready. Oh. And I went to the studio and dropped. Hmm. And here we are today. Hmm. Yeah. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> you know, because I don't you think that maybe that particular song would have been done differently or would have been done with another beat without necessarily replicating a secular beat because it's becoming a trend mm -hmm. yes we, are, we it's becoming a trend gospel artists ministers of god mm -hmm. taking a secular trends mm -hmm. to 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 preach a particular message don't you think that's a problem god is not specific about the the, the way you do beats to come to him okay he's he's concerned about your heart you can rap to god he enjoys it that's a job yeah so now my way my my style is this the world should know that you loving the song because he's singing to a lady and maybe loving it because of the beat I want the world to understand that I can equally use that beat to praise God. You mustn't use the beat for a secular purpose. Mm -hmm. The same beat that is being used for gospel can still be used for a secular purpose. But you know, every every beat comes with the spirit. I'm not a I'm not an, <laughs> a musician. Yeah. But I know that each beat comes with a spirit. Yeah. It comes with a particular message. Okay. Now when you Take a secular beat yeah. and do a gospel song with it. Okay. Don't you think there is a contrast of spirits? As in there, 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 there will be this clash. Of spirits. Yeah, there'll be a clash, there'll be a clash of spirit and the lesser spirit has to bow. The, so the should beat. we should we really, you know, come to that point where we take a a, a confrontation as that that trivia? To we're, preach. We are we are we are we are in a world where people need to see before they believe. Okay, okay. We are in an era where people will must see before they believe. Okay. And uh, the devil is evolving every day. His, his strategies on how to capture people to himself daily. Mm -hmm. So we as Christians, as ministers, we are called to strategize daily on how to capture people back to God. Okay. Beats. A beat can be devilish depending on how you call it or how okay. you feel about it okay a beat becomes spiritual or that you you give a spirit to a beat okay yeah, yeah. That's, some that's people I mean, some people will bear their name elizabeth or mary okay there are marys that are prostitutes okay there are marys that god used to bring jesus okay so you give the meaning to that beat what you want the beat to do mm -hmm. You pray to God, God's power, and even if it was a devilish spirit, mm -hmm. I am coming with a stronger spirit okay. to overthrow the devilish spirit. All right. So, but in a nutshell, the youths of today are going off. So, we now look into what do they really want? We've given them snatch, ada, and so on. I've given them some sort of praise, worship, those type of hymns in the Roman Catholic Church, and so forth. It seems not to be working. It's, I said it seems not to. I did not say it's not working. It seems not to be working. Now, what is the devil now doing? He's using so much of some sort of types of beats to capture people to himself. Okay, okay now, we can equally use that same beat hmm? mm -hmm. and give you the Spirit of God through that beat okay. by preaching the Word. Okay. It's not, it doesn't really matter. It's just like, okay, you move into a or you buy a piece of land mm -hmm. and that land was a shrine okay. and the people had been they had buried charms there and so on and so forth will you stay away from the land because it, it, it was a shrine he said no the bible says i've given you dominion okay. so you are going to dominate the land babalola late babalola when they gave him a forest to build his church the king that gave him the forest thought he was going to die but when he gave the forest to the forest to Babalola, what happened? Babalola thanked him. Thank him. He must 
thank him so much and the king was laughing the story is online the write-up is there i read it the king was laughing but because he knew whom he was he did not lament when he entered the forest to cut the trees down with his prayer warriors this the 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 write-up claims that they could hear people in a group running hectares that jamming them the, uh, themselves mm -hmm. and so on so when you know who you are you are no longer afraid of anything i can take any beat and transform it to a spiritual beat but now that you did the transformation of the beat and the transcription of the lyrics yeah how do we go from here how do we go <laughs> where do we go right there? god <laughs> is our guide and he is our leader okay he best knows where to lead us to if i could pray to god in the and the god how do i go about this and then he gave me the way out then he's okay with it okay so if he wasn't okay with it he wouldn't give me the way out hmm. so god is okay with it yeah according to yeah <laughs> just say god is okay with it yeah and uh, he gave him the, the way, way out forward yeah. now let, let's talk about the 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 the, the graphics the images yeah. they are really really nice thank you yes uh, thank you. paintings art and other rest. Yeah. are you an artist <laughs> no uh, actually <laughs> virtual art. no my uh, my video producer mn mm. uh, yeah mn mn films okay. uh, he's in charge of all that so when i play the song to him and uh, he listened to it he came up with a concept and everything and uh, the team my duty is just to go and shoot even the location is not my work my duty i, I sense beat produce the beat and recorded did the mastering and so on and so forth mm -hmm. then mn films took over the video mm -hmm. so my duty is just like in the studio in the audio studio my duty is, is to come and sing when i finish singing i go my way so you finish the job and send it and send it to me i pay you then the video section the video studio my duty is to come to the scene and perform the way you are guiding and directing me okay yeah so um, i don't really know much about how he came about that the painting the settings uh, mm. it's not really i don't have much of it if he was here who best he is well placed to tell you how yeah. he came about that yes I, I it's really good yeah it's commendable it, yeah. it added a little a different flair to the music and i really really like it <laughs> that way okay we're, we're going to come back to this discussion but before we do i want us to take uh, gospel actualities and i'm going to leave you people with uh, uh, magnify magnify is a song by uh, dr kareen atem and uh, the singing prophet dr kareen is based in the usa and uh, the singing prophet uh, Rochi Osvalin here in Cameroon. We're going to use that as our transition to gospel actualities. Let's go. Praise waits for our God in Zion. Highest praise. Hallelujah, hallelujah. 
course, praise wait for our God in Zion. Let's take gospel actually to work starting with the Congress. The Congress starts tomorrow. Yes, the Congress starts tomorrow. Tomorrow is the 31st. Mm -hmm. It's the 31st, and uh, you can come in the morning and with your coat, of course, and collect your badges so that in the evening you come freely to come and dance to come and sing to come and worship to come and encounter god even more at this wonderful convention so i'm inviting all of you to be there for the congress 2022 it is titled or theme strategic invasion yes it's, it's one thing to to invade it's another thing to do it strategically so we have a lot of ministers coming far and near to minister to us from ivory coast to uganda to nigeria and of course to cameroon so have last week i told you to make plans to be there I, i'm sure by now you have made plans i'm sure you have put everything you need in place to be part of the congress 2022 You will not regret it. Le congrès 2022 est là, six jours de renouvellement d'esprit et d'impartition d'enseignement sur les stratégies d'invasion de toutes les sphères d'influence. Forfait Santa organise The Congress 2022 du 31 octobre au 5 novembre 2022 sous le thème « Invasion stratégique ». Orateur, apôtre Joshua Selman, pasteur Jerry Eze, apôtre Livingstone Bajangala, révérend Raoul Wafo, bishop Chris Raymond, docteur Pepe Nomana, Révérend Victor Makembe, Bishop Elect Collins Wilson, Apôtre Tony Koumbe, sous la coordination de son Excellence le Docteur Hippol et la Révérende Leslie Mbwapo. Au programme, 6h, 7h, matin de gloire, 9h, 12h, plénière matinale, 12h30, 15h, atelier, 17h, 21h30, session du soir. The Congress 2022, du 31 octobre au 5 novembre 2022, au stade de Bépanda, au Sport Douala. Pour plus d'informations et partenariats, Contactez-nous au 656 08 64 43 678 82 37 78. The Congress 2022, rejoignez-nous. And of course, uh, we have a uh, worship exodus that's coming. I told you last week that I am going to be there to host you. Yes, we are doing kingdom business and we must come and slay on the red carpet. Yes, because Christ too, the man for Nyanga, you understand? Oui, le Seigneur aime le Nyanga. Ah oui, ah oui. Oui, si, 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 c'est la première fois que tu entends ça. Il faut que moi je te rappelle aujourd'hui que le, le Seigneur aime quand nous, on est stylé, quand on porte des designs, hein? quand, on est, quand on est belle. Donc, je vous invite à Boya le, le 13 novembre. Je serai là pour le tapis rouge, pour Worship Exodus. Worship Exodus, c'est cet euh, événement qui rassemble les... les les, les, les enfants de Dieu de, de, qui viennent dans tout le euh, tout continent, soit africaine, soit européen, soit tu as de l'Asie, euh, si, même tu es chinois, même tu es espagnol, euh, on, on, on ne veut même pas savoir là où tu serais. Mais, tout ce qu'on on, on, on nous a dit, c'est qu'il faut qu'on on rassemble, c'est une nuit de, de, de louange oui, et d'adoration. Oui. Et ça va nous permettre de savourer euh, la présence de Dieu. Dieu, oui, parce que c'est important d'être là avec les frères. So, make it a date to be there for Worship Exodus this year. You're going to enjoy it. I'm looking forward to see uh, Dr. Karine uh, with her latest release, it, 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 uh, You Go Finish Him. I'm also looking forward to see uh, uh, Borda Solo. It's been long. We got to hear from him. I would, I would like to know what's up, you know. And uh, if you've heard the song, Yahweh, God of Miracle, I can, yes, that he's the one that sang it and he's going to be there and a lot of wonderful Cameroonian artists are going to be there so make plans to be there at the worship exodus is taking place this year at uh, the Boya Omnisport Stadium so invite somebody call your village people tell somebody to tell somebody that on the 13th of November we have worship exodus and of course on the 5th of um, November we have the Bora Lukalu in concert 
yeah the bride of color is going to be here from the uh, on the feet of november and uh, we're going to have tenella we're going to have minister benita we're going to have give michelle it's here at paku vita look at that flyer well choose your your pass you know wherever you want to be whatever uh, uh, amount you want to pay if you want to be vip if you want to be classic just choose but try to be at Paku Vita on the 5th of November. Invite a brother, invite a sister, invite your family people. It's very important. Of course, we are going to have Royal Flex that's coming up in December. Yeah, Royal Flex is the gathering of queens and kings in the kingdom it's a realization gala and it's that moment of fellowship the moment of kingdom networking that's the way i call it kingdom networking we get to network with entrepreneurs in the in the in the kingdom yes we, we have powerful entrepreneurs that are doing wonderful things out there that are christians and um, worship exodus permits you to meet such people you get to rub minds so that even as we give god our worship someday we'll give him our substance because giving god your substance is also another way of worshiping him yes if you did not know then now you know we have um, a powerful book coming up uh, the power of love by uh, graciously ashu she's also uh she's on she doubles as a, a minister and she's uh coming up with this beautiful book titled the power of love mm -hmm. the power of love it's coming very very soon so prepare your money to buy mm -hmm. prepare your money to buy and uh, when you read it i'm sure that you are going to be blessed uh, of course we on this november we still have the croisa de prière et de louange de louange et de jeûne is still going on it's a 40 days uh, f uh, uh, prayer and and, and praise and fast session it started on the 17th and it's ending on the 25th of november so you still have time and of course make sure you are there for gospel festival africa is taking place in edea on the 12th of november it's uh, going to be a l'esplanade de prefecture de dea yes it's it, it's there we have uh, Plusieurs there are going to be so many so many gifts there that you can win yeah it's a, it's a fun kind of you know gospel fun fair kind of event and we we'll have in zero day as guest artist it is uh, it is hosted by the movement gospel festival africa so please inscribe on the number on your screen we oui. on a number on the flyer si vous voulez vous inscrire, s'il vous plaît, il faut appeler pour savoir comment vous allez, pour vous pouvez vous inscrire, pour, pour prendre, pour être euh, là pour cet événement. On a le biosphère de Louange, ça comme dans le 6, oui, ça serait le 6 novembre à 17h et c'est à Sanon de Koti, oui, Sanon de Koti à 200 mètres avant le tunnel Lorbaba. Oui, donc si vous êtes à leur baba, eh, il faut que vous eh, vous prendre cette contact, de regarder le fly eh, et ça serait à de, ça commence à 17 eh, on a on, on a les ministres qui viennent de Douala, de Yaoundé et partout au Cameroun, je vois Gashmia, je vois Lor Niri, je vois Chantre Parfait, je vois Di, Di The Voice ouais, et on a Chantre Ingrid qui serait là juste pour vous. Alors l'info line est sur le flyer, alors vous pouvez appeler et euh, pr prendre l'invitation ou l'avenir ou la l'avenue de louange ou avenue of worship comme c'est sur le flyer et vous invite aussi le 6 novembre ici à yaoundé alors si vous n'êtes pas euh, à, à douala pour, pour prendre du part à euh, le biosphère de louange vous pouvez être là à l'avenue of worship et euh, c'est euh, gratuit ah oui c'est gratuit et ça va prendre lieu à stade de tongolo Stade de Tongolo et à Yaoundé au niveau des feux. 
Oui. Alors, vous allez regarder le flyer aussi. Appelez, renseignez-vous de comment vous pouvez prendre, vous pouvez prendre part dans cet événement. Et alors, il y aura le lunch, il y aura l'adoration, l'évangélisation, il y aura les sketchs, il y aura aussi la danse. Donc, il faut que vous ne ratez pas. Et ça commence euh, euh, à 14 h jusqu'à 18h30. Alors, il faut que vous prenez ce rendez-vous. C'est bien, bien important que vous soyez là. Et euh, je pense que ça, cela va nous prendre... OK, avant que je ne parle, il y a le temps de couronnement des fils de Dieu. Le temps de couronnement des fils de Dieu, ça, va, ça vient le 27 novembre à, à Chapiteau. Rimemos à quoi? C'est ici à Douala, entre libre et gratuit. Donc, tout ce que vous devez faire, c'est de, juste d'appeler. Oui, appeler le, le numéro sur le flyer. C'est une soirée d'adoration. Et le thème, c'est le temps de couronnement des fils de Dieu. Et moi, j'aime quand, moi, moi, j'aime quand les, les, les chrétiens on euh, se renseigne et c'est dans ça se ce, ce développe dans ce qui concerne pas seulement euh, dans le secteur euh, religieux mais aussi dans le secteur entrepreneuriat et d'autres secteurs en fait c'est pour ça que je, je vais vous donner cette information et c'est ça oh je déjà même passé hein j'aurais vous donner mais c'est déjà passé c'était un meetup le meetup des jeunes entrepreneurs chrétiens et c'était une conférence, débat, atelier pratique, talk show, résultat, repas fraternel. Et c'était à Simbok. Oh, peut-être si vous avez raté ça, parce que je pense que l'année prochaine, il y aura encore cet euh, euh, événement. Et ne ratez pas surtout, il faut que vous preniez contact. Il y a le showcase. Ok, non. On, on va laisser le showcase pour maintenant. Il y a le séminaire de l'excellence académique édition 5, prix d'excellence Zakaria Tene Fomu, ok? Ça, 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 ça serait du 17 au 18 décembre. On va vous, on va vous, on va vous, on va vous amener, on va vous apporter en fait l'information du lieu et comment vous pouvez participer. And uh, that takes us to the end of gospel actualities. And let's come back now in the studio with my guest today. It's fire for fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's fire for fire. Yeah. Yes. Questions have to be answered. Exactly. Yes. We need to clarify things. Okay. Yeah. You made mention that not every song is to be sung in church. Yeah. So definitely you're not expecting this your particular song to be sung in church. Actually, I am not saying that my song cannot be sung in church. No. Okay. My point of view is this. Like I said earlier, everybody has a call. Okay. And everybody understands their call. I can't understand your call more than you do. Mm -hmm. So, you best know your call and okay. you know how you are working with God. Mm -hmm. So, I know my call mm -hmm. in the music industry as a yeah. gospel music minister. All right. So, if my song doesn't suit a particular program in church. All right. There is no need playing it there. Okay. Secondly, church is in the heart of man. Okay. Church is not a building. Mm. To me, that's my personal point of view. Church, the building you go to, I call it a Bible school, where you go and sit and listen to the inspired men of God and you come and practice it outside. Mm -hmm. The word of God says that he who practices the word, in the book of Acts, he who practices the word is far greater than he who preaches the word. Okay. So I am concerned about you embracing my music in your heart. I'm not so much concerned about the music being sung in church. Besides, judgment will start in the house of God. Mm -hmm. I get what I'm saying? Okay. So, be they played in church or not, I'm not concerned. I am, I am after the lost soul. Okay. I am not after the winning soul. Okay. Reasons I am giving to the lost soul what you know when you want to capture a thief mm -hmm. you first of all have to behave like one okay to go along with them mm -hmm. so that they believe that you are part of their gang mm -hmm. so that they should be able to expose who they really are to you mm -hmm. then at that point in time you will know how to capture them so if you want to win a soul for instance you can meet a soul that is taking marijuana hard drugs 
and you just start preaching to their soul. Hey, it's not good. Hey, it's not that. Hey, you need wisdom to convert such a person. You need divine grace to be able to convert such a person. So you first of all need to play along. There are souls I've converted, for instance, in Nigeria. I met them. They were heart drug addicts. How did I come? How did I convert them? I, I believe they are listening to me now. I started by playing along with them. I will even buy the drug and give them. I will buy the, the cigarette, give them. Is it the wheat? I will give them. Oh, I, want, I need money to buy wheat. I will give it. I need money to go and take, to go and buy uh, this. I will give it. Why? I'm not giving. When I'm giving, see, when you are giving to somebody, you, you need to have the attitude of constant meditation. That's why God told Joshua, let my word should not depart from, depart from thy heart. Mm -hmm. Because a constant med meditation on God's word is a constant presence with God. So when you give, you are giving with a praying, a praying point in your heart. Mm -hmm. As you are giving, what you are praying about follows. follows. Mm -hmm. So when I'm giving the money, okay, you want money to buy six cigarette i am not there to destroy you when i'm giving i have my short prayer in my heart my goal is to win you now for me to win you i don't need to come harsh if i come harsh you will rubbish me you won't even believe me you won't even accept it mm -hmm. so i first need to follow you along so basically you are out to lure yeah the lost souls. Yeah, my music. My my music is not for the for the winning solo. Okay. That's why I'm I'm circle around <laughs> mercy mm -hmm. and love mm -hmm. because when divine mercy comes upon you, mm -hmm. his love automatically starts speaking for you instantly. Wow. That's good. so I'm concerned about the mercy of God upon you, mm. the lordship. You know, it's amazing to to hear your conviction. <laughs> <laughs> it's really really amazing. So yeah. any projects in hand already should be expecting something from zero just anytime soon yeah you should be expecting my next release the mm -hmm. title is mercy all right your okay. mercy your mercy mm -hmm. your mercy is, so is, speaking is it, for me is it reggae your is mercy it, is it reggae your mercy, <laughs> your mercy is so speaking for me it's yeah, reggae yeah. reggae <laughs> i'm still where i am because of your mercy mm -hmm. oh lord i'm grateful yeah 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 i'm still where i am because of your mercies Oh Lord, I'm grateful, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Lord, you know you're my father. Without you, I am nobody. Mm -mm, don't sing it all. <laughs> oh, thank if you. If you sing it all, don't walk down the road again. Yeah. I, so actually, I wanted to... Like a free concert. I wanted to release it uh, this ne next month, that's in November. Mm -hmm. But my team, my crew, uh, they advised that, no, let's, let's give time for I Am In Love With Jesus all right. to move off on the... We look into either ending uh, December or early next year. That call. So we can, we have everything, the concept and everything is down. The video shooting location, every set is down. Is down. We're even ready to shoot it. Mm -hmm. We're ready to shoot the video. But as it is, like I said, I do nothing without bringing God in the picture. Okay. Because the book of Proverbs 3, 4, 5. I think four five or six five or five six i mean says that do not depend on what you think you know mm -hmm. and the, in everything you do acknowledge his presence in another sense bring him and he will show you the right way mm -hmm. so i am uh, that particular verse it works for me personally so in any bit of thing i do i make sure god is part of it even in sin i bring him in the sinning picture because nobody is righteous mm -hmm. you need god's grace to come out of a particular sin you can't yeah. do it on your own yeah it is not by your power mm -hmm. god needs to be involved before you can be free from the grips of the devil mm -hmm. because you can't do it on your own all right we're anticipating mercy by yeah. so just your very mercy. soon yeah. so if you are joined just joining us this has been an amazing and a sweet <laughs> edition. At least I got the <laughs> I got the chance to shoot my shots today. Yeah. And my fire for fire mission was successful. <laughs> and you, I'm Jesus. really happy that you came all the way from Nigeria yeah. to deliver to to yeah, grace our yeah. our show. We are really grateful and happy to meet you. We pray we get to see you often. Yeah.
your, this is your house. <laughs> it's an honor. It's yeah. an honor. When I, when I, when I, when I receive the invitation, uh, like, let me just be clear on this. Different churches in Nigeria have called me up. Mm -hmm. Even in Cambria, I don't want to be mentioning churches. Mm -hmm. Have called me up in their church mm -hmm. for performance. Mm -hmm. But like I said, I bring God in the picture mm -hmm. of everything. Mm -hmm. So when something comes, I I know my God. Mm -hmm. when the worst thing you can ever do as a Christian is not to know your God. Mm -hmm. You must know your God the way you know the person you love mm -hmm. or your wife or your husband. So I know my God. So I always go to my God. What do you have to say about this? So when I received your invitation mm -hmm. and I took it to the altar, mm -hmm. God, what do you have to say? Yeah. <laughs> and the God said, Go. Oh, are we having here today? And this is me here. <laughs> this is him here today. <laughs> if God has said no, mm. I would have told you it's, I can't make it. Ah, that God, <laughs> oh, that is not saying no. Yeah. So God, it had to be here because uh, the questions had just overcrowded yeah. my head. I didn't know who to answer and how to do it. Thank God you came to answer them yourself. So shout out to your record level. You have any? Sorry? Do you have a record level? Yeah, so Waves of Rema Studios. Shout out to I even have of a, Rema new, a new a new artist I just signed and she's a oh. Cameroonian. So you're a producer too? Yeah, I have mm. a new artist I just signed. Uh, she's a, uh, a Cameroonian. Okay. So okay. when I when I signed her, Goris Lael, and uh, I've produced, she has songs already. Normally, she's supposed to be have video. She'll be coming up anytime soon, okay. either this November or um, uh, uh, early December okay. and uh, she's so magical wow so and um, there are others on ground that uh, they are powerful mm -hmm. you know all these things has to do with budget yes yeah I'm concerned about budget mm -hmm. so there are a lot of them in the studio waves of Rema studio belongs to me the founder. Wow. wow yeah so and uh, you will see many things as they are going on that core yeah. so we're waiting we're looking forward to have la hell yeah. very very god is liar god is liar yeah wow yeah. We're, we're looking forward to have her and uh, before we go producer is signaling already yeah jealousy jealousy <laughs> 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 he's signaling already yeah. so we have to go any last words for your uh, fans out there thank you my fans like there. thank you very much and i keep telling you people if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Mm -hmm. Please, make prayer the standard of your life. That's the way out. And I, a shout out to my audio producer, Sense B Studio, they specified. Mm -hmm. And um, a shout out to my video producer, MN Films. Thank you very much. And to the entire crew, my graphics designer and so on. Thank you very much for this project. And thank you, the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. It's by God's grace that this has come to pass. Yes. Thanks to everybody in the world. God bless you. God bless you. Yeah. So we're going to dance to I'm in love with Jesus. Yeah. yeah we have to dance. <laughs> and just down with us. Have a beautiful week. And do not forget, see you at the Congress. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> this is the me Shamaya. Oh my God, you are the king of kings. Even when my brain just did da da da. Only united my father. Roger. Thank you, Jesus. Run, run. Only united my corner. Hola. Yeah. This is for my great dreams. Yeah. You see this life, yeah, now God did give them to me You see this life, yeah, now God did give them to me You see this life, yeah, now God did give them to me yeah. You see this life, yeah, now God did give them to me I'm in love, I'm in love
Papa, mama, dance on for him yeah. Dance on, dance on, dance on for him He's the father of nations He never lies, he never fails He never quits He is the father, he is the son He is the spirit, somebody's son Straight to the top This life you make me shamaya Oh my lord, you are the king of kings Even when my brain touch the tanana Only unite them my corner This life you make me shamaya Oh my lord, you are the king of kings Even when my brain touch the tanana Now God give them to me. You see this life, now God give them to me. You see this life, now God give them to me. You see this life, now God give them to me. I'm in love. I'm